Hello everybody, my name is Markiplier and welcome to Dark Cut. This is a game that came out a while ago in Flash, made by JMTB02, who's one of my favorite game developers, especially in the Flash Newgrounds era. If you think of this game, think Medieval Times meets Surgeon Simulator, even though this came out way before Surgeon Simulator ever did. You're just, you're a doctor. Okay, I'll let the, I'll let the game explain itself. Dear most humble scholar, with haste, please remove the arrow from Captain Harold's right leg. We need him on the battlefield by tomorrow morning. Chop chop! Please hurry and remember we want the least amount of pain possible. Regards, the Royal Guard. The douchebags. Now I have played this one before and I say this one because there's two more games that I have not played. But I kind of wanted to show you guys, like, what it's all about because it's kind of ridiculous and kind of brutal and kind of horrible. And also it's really fun! So, I can't... I can't really complain, even when spatters of blood are going all over the screen, and I have to extract all this bullshit out of people's bodies. Eeeh. Replant some human tissue. Eeeh. Eeeh. Oh, good enough. Passed! Why not? I- I did great, in my own humble opinion. I'm fantastic. Okay. Dear most humble scholar, please remove these weird boils from this individual. We have a feeling it is some kind of new disease. Not sure, not experts on the subject, so use any means necessary to cleanse, remove, and eliminate the problem. Regards, the douchebags known as the Royal Guard. <laughs> now, this is where the game starts to get a little bit gross. Because it's, it says, scrub the bubonic plague boils. Oh, let me just, let me just get my hands all in the- Nurse, if you wouldn't mind, please hand me the, the vinegar and, uh, the, the rose water, if you wouldn't mind. I couldn't remember what it was. It's been a while since I played this game, everybody. Oh, uh, split open the first boil. Uh, uh, <laughs> oh, God, that one spattered. <laughs> Eh, I should probably put a warning at the beginning of this game, but for some reason, like, this was suggested after I played, uh, uh, The Visitor, because it's kind of in, in the same era of games. It's got that morbid curiosity factor, like, you don't want to see this stuff. You really don't, or at least I don't. Ugh. But, I mean, you have to extract pus. It's, it's not exactly the most pleasant of games, but it's- Cut the veins to clear passageways. What? Ah, I just slit his throat! Why? Uh, is this how they did it back then? I'm not exactly sure. It's, it's been a long time since I played this one. I don't remember this. Uh, Restitch the skin by crisscross. You know, I wouldn't need to do that if I didn't cut up in his throat in the beginning, but that's just my opinion. What do I know? Nurse, you're giving me bad direction here, you know what I mean? Uh, this is before I learned to tell you to shut up. Uh, Okay, so that's good. Oh, scrub the entire area. Why not? Does go all wishy-washy with everything? Well, you know what they say, once you wish upon a star, you'll scrub all those boils away. I'm not sure that's what they said. Either way, I did great, I think. Dear most humble scholar, upon thine discretion we have brought the vampire to your abode, eh? So you may take care of Riddy in the correct fashion. Please take care of this problem immediately. One false move will most likely be your death. Regards to royal- Nurse! Where do you get these cases from? I don't remember this at all! Ugh. Alright. God damn, why do I have to do this? Let me get my crucif- Oh! Oh! Oh, you're gonna make me time this, eh? Eh. Oh, aim- What do I gotta press space? Oh, good! Eh! Oh, God, I gotta click this time. Eh. 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 Okay, <laughs> what? I don't really know what I'm supposed to do now! Oh, implant garlic into the wound, of course, because this is the proper way to kill a vampire. Actually, I wouldn't be surprised if this is like the original document- uh oh. He's probably gonna kill me after this. I wouldn't be surprised if this is actually the documented way that you're supposed to get rid of a- Eh! Eh, what am I gonna kiss him? Oh, I'm gonna mark the axe line, oh. That's much less good than kissing him. Eh. Alright, oh. Oh no. Oh no. Eh! Oh god. Oh, come on! Ah! Oh, what the hell? What a bunch of baloney! I don't like that. I don't like that at all. All right, hang on. What? I have to start in the beginning! What a bunch of bull! What a piece of shit! Ah, god damn it. Okay, I'll be back. 
Be right back. Okay, here we go. Here we go again. I can't mess this one up again. Oh, man. Bink, bink. It's like playing one of those timing games in an arcade. Why do I need to do this? Bink, 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 bink. Oh, come on. Oh, oh, I did it. Oh, I thought for sure I would have to be stuck on that forever. Oh. Dear most humble scholar, seeing you made it thus far, we were expecting much less from you. Thank you, douchebags. In fact, we were expecting nothing. Oh, glorious douchebags, you're welcome. At that, congratulations, you have done well. I appreciate it. Regards, the royal douchebags. So anyway, that was it. But there is Dark Cut 2 and 3, which I've never played before, and they have a lot more work put into them. Uh, at least I think. JMTB02 has made some really incredible games uh, in the past. like. This is the only level, uh, Achievement Unlocked, uh, something like you, like, the, he's made a lot of those types of games, and you've probably played one of his games in the past. He's phenomenal. Go look him up. If you haven't played him already, he makes great stuff. So thank you all so much for watching. Let me know if you want to see Dark Cut 2 and 3, if you're weird like that, in the description below, or in the comments below. And as always, I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye! Something's gonna happen. I got some questions for you. 63. 204863. I don't know what that means. Oh, 